Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me in the commentary position is the former England defender, Lee Dixon. And every expectation that this will be a captivating contest. It's Poland versus the Netherlands. Well, thank you, Derek. Glorious atmosphere here. Really looking forward to it. The fans are too. The players look like they're up for it. This could be end to end. We could get goals today, Derek. And the lineup for the home side. And this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them. But it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. This is how the visitors will set up today. It does rather look as though it's going to be a battle of the 4-5-1 formations in this game. Similar setups, Lee. Well, it looks lovely in the graphic, doesn't it? There's players everywhere. They have got the freedom to roam around the pitch how they see fit. There is some structure to it, but that lone striker up front needs support. Not only around him, but from wide areas of two. The supply line will come from the wide midfield players and maybe the overlapping fullbacks. Sebastian Szymanowski. They couldn't maintain possession. Depay. What can they do from here? Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Sometimes the defender reads your mind. That's what happened to Lewandowski. Well, he was a Champions League runner-up in his Borussia Dortmund days, Robert Lewandowski, and still one of the best in the business when it comes to plundering. Well, centre-forward play doesn't come much better than this guy. He's a dying breed, there's not many of his type around. Scores with both feet, heads goals, tap-ins, shots from outside the box. A real good all-rounder. Take it away. Kamil Groszycki. An attack full of promise. Well, it was a very good looking move, but alas, no end product. De Jong. Poor pass. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Wijnaldum. It's now with Van der Beek. Wijnaldum. He's in behind the defence here. Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Depay. This looks threatening. Real chance. Thwarted by Glick. Groszycki. Opportunity in the wide area.
It is to be a throw-in. And a useful cross. He succeeds in clearing it. Daniel Malin. Now with De Jong. Depay. Read it well. Well, he played that one really well. And room now out on the flank. And crossing towards the far post. In it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, as we see again, that's how to score goals. Get the ball into the box from wide areas. And then it just gets better and better from there. Superb. Softly passing the volley into the net. Lovely goal. The opening goal of the game then. Well, great read there to intercept. Kamil Grosicki. Lewandowski now. He's found a pocket of space. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. And space for them here on the flank. Wijnaldum. Malen with it. De Jong. Well, a key block from Glick. This could square the game. Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. Linetti. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. Jorginho Wijnaldum, normally a player who dazzles, but that hasn't happened today, Lee. Well, if you don't get back into this game, his lack of real potency will be the key factor. Defenders have marked him too easily. They've been comfortable with his game today. It's not been enough of a threat for me. Teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Here's Berghaus. And teammates to play it to. Interception to snuff out the danger. The hosts are struggling in terms of possession, but when they've had the ball, they keep delivering the sucker punch. A great advert for low possession, counter-attacking football. It's really working. Depay. Wijnaldum. Did well to win the ball back. Linetti. Chance to cross. Now oh, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. So a throw in here. Now well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Moving into the advanced position. Depay. Did look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. And a throw-in it's going to be. Depay. And he read it well, intercepting it. How can he take them on and beat them? Another classic example of how to intercept. And turned out of play, so it will be a throw-in. Substitution time it is. 
De Jong, real danger. Oh, great defending. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. And fed forwards. And the flag does go up. Must have been close. Linetti. Magnificent read. Fine tackle. Stefan de Frey. Zielinski. That's a useful cross. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Oh, getting the ball forward. A chance to whip it in. And he's through here. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. And now can he keep calm? Will he? Late drama here. Level once more. Incredible scenes. Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely, quick counter-attack that sets up the chance. And then through on goal, do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Krikoviak. It's with Karol Linetti. Level pegging, but can they change that? Excellent defending. The pie. Here's Berghaus. Frankie de Jong. The pie. Could cross it in here. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. De Jong. Promising looking ball. The pressure was on the keeper following the threaded pass. And the referee blows his whistle. Still all square after 90 minutes.